guys if you are looking for like a cursor alternative then this is a good option for you mainly because this just got launched yesterday this is launched by alibaba this is like an agency coding platform you just give the task and the ai will go and code it for you so it's completely hands off and the best part is you can code it with all the main closed source models like gpt5 sonnet 4 gemini 2.5 pro etc this looks really promising what attracted me to do this video is the pricing as you can see it's zero dollar per month and the pricing is not yet announced so it's free access during the preview period so it will be announced in the coming days till then you can use it for free thank you for being our early user you can continue using till this free but they, they will always have a free plan so that's like an advantage and if you want you can also upgrade to the future plan just give it like a, a task as you can see and it will code that specific thing for you just like all the other development tools like vs code and cursor it's the same so you don't have to learn anything new if you are already familiar with the cursor or vs code i think it's a fork of vs code so everything looks the same and when you actually install it you will have the option to export everything from cursor or vs code and you can get started right away what are some of the features that makes this really great intelligent code base search so instantly pinpoint relevant code across your entire code base so it has got like a built-in in indexing system and that's really important these days because the AI context window is really limited having an inbuilt indexing is really important so that the AI knows where to search and what to look for when we give it like a prompt because of that it can give you like advanced repository insights memory for continuous improvement and tool use it can also use mcps and things like that always the best model this is something that i am really not fond of because we are not getting the option to choose the model that we want as you can see it uses gemini gpt and cloud and it it chooses which model to use we don't have that option at least as of now so if you select a tab it's context aware of what's in that tab comprehensive context you can add in your own context you can wikilize your code base uncover architecture and design memories and you can add your own memories and rules you can use inline chat without switching between context so just click on download and it will download like a 136 mb file but you need around 600 or 700 mb of free space to actually install it and make sure that you have 4 gb of before you install it so that it works smoothly so once you install it this is how it will look similar to how vs code looks you can see the quest mode here you can also add the extensions that you want you can click on this button and click open a project and if you already have a project just open it so i'm just opening a project that i already have once you open it as you can see you can see the to ask about the code base and the other is the agent that will go and do task for you so let me see what we can do with this if you are not seeing the panel just click on this button toggle ai sidebar that will show the chat bar and so i am not adding any context now so let me see if it can figure out directly from the folder what i have opened is like a chrome extension that i have shared with you see this is the chrome extension it's a text-to-speech chrome extension let's see if it can add like a button to switch between dark and light theme okay dark and light mode and let's see how fast it can do and whether it can do this without any errors can you please go through the code and figure out how it works and implement a new functionality where we can choose between dark and light mode so as you can see we have no option to choose the language models here so let me just click on enter and see how it does that task So as you can see it's going and reading through the files and it's understanding all the proper files and it's figuring out where to add this new functionality that I asked for. 
now it's creating like a detailed to-do list see so that uh, it is not deviating from the actual task in hand now it's actually implementing so look at how fast it's making the changes so it understand the code it's coming up with a plan and now it's actually implementing it i'm not fast forwarding or anything it's this is the actual speed of what's happening so as you can see we can see the file it changed one file the pop-up html file and now it's opening up the code and showing us what are the changes and i think it automatically applied it so we have the option to apply and reject i'm not applying it let's see if it can be auto so it's automatically applied that changes without was having to click that button every now and then that's good okay it's making the changes so while that is fixing that let me just show you how the settings work so here when you click on your profile and you click on coder setting just click on that and here you can see you can change from different languages and you can talk in these languages with ai and for code completion you can allow context aware code suggestions on both line and function level you can toggle this on and off and next edit suggestions also can be toggled and you can also select long completion length or short or medium let's keep it as default for now and search tools in ask mode so if you want you can enable that ask mode you have the option to enable mcp tools which is off by default so if you want you can turn it on and i'll allow to search web for relevant information from the url in ask and agent mode so yeah if it want to search using web um, it will ask or if you don't want it to ask you can set it to auto execute so we can toggle this on or off if we want to enable quest mode and the, like in client we also have the mcp servers here as you can see just click on install and install any of the mcp servers that you want and you can also set up your own rules and if you want it to automatically improve based on your conversation enable this so it will take that and into the context when it sends the prompt so this is really important we need to have this file option selected this will automatically create and update index for the code base so there is a limit right so 10,000 files so yeah even that's like a big code base that it can understand so this is the important functionality that i like about this specific software and you also have advanced proxy settings as well enable if you want to enable you can enable or disable automatic updates so that's the quick settings so i have clicked on accept and as you can see it have accepted all the files there it made the changes there is some problems are also wrong. let me see if i can add we can add files folders and images how do I add files? Okay, you can talk to specific files. Maybe what are the slash commands? Oh, so you can clear context. So it's the slash commands, you can use it to clear the context or start a new chat. That's the difference between slash commands. I think it it's validating the accessibility and ensuring theme changes works so long so it's still checking it it finally finished the extensions new feature update let's see if that's already implemented okay it implemented this looks really nice as you can see you can switch between different teams so it's working 
and the button looks really great so as you can see this software actually works and i have shown you the real use case as well guys very good software tested it did not even show me like any issues and figured out everything by itself created the plan implemented executed everything and yeah you just sit back enjoy and relax while it's doing its task you can switch to the quest mode so here it will ask the design first and then you can click on execute it directly so that way you will have more control over the task that you are doing this is a really powerful option but as you can see the chat mode also works really great and i think this will be really helpful if you are starting from scratch and you can chat with ai build a plan and then after that you can just click on this execute directly and it will go and execute the project for you if you have any project in mind if you have a tight budget maybe you are a student or if you don't have that money that you can spend on like a 20 dollar plan for cursor definitely check it out while this last uh, do all your projects that wanted and i believe this will definitely help you out i hope you will learn something new if you like this please don't forget to like share and subscribe for more future videos again thank you for watching and have a great day click that thumb and join the dream stay in the loop with the latest vibe hit that bell